At the end of September, I published a very beautiful video, probably the best, technically speaking, video I've made so far. So I highly recommend you to check it out. It's called What You're Missing Outside of Just a Tarot Room. And one week after that, it was the beginning of October at this point, I just arrived to New York City to spend the fall season and I made a live stream. After that, I disappeared from the internet for three months until now. Or I guess that's what people think. I still nowadays keep getting comments, messages and emails from subscribers that have been feeling worried that something badly serious happened to me in these past three months. Maybe I got severely sick or even that I got pregnant. So here I am today, I will explain you what happened. Yes, I took a long break from my usual weekly vlogs to edit a full-length travel documentary that is called Via Francigena, Walking in the Heart of Italy, which you can find published on my website right now. It's freely watchable by anyone at the moment. That took a lot of work and parallel to that, I was doing some work that you obviously could not see. I was finishing to build my new website, guadishamerijane.com, that you can now navigate if you want. And while you're there, remember also to subscribe to my newsletter because that's also a project I've been working on in the past three months. My new newsletter series that's gonna start being sending off in a couple of weeks. It's a very well curated one. I spend quite a bit of time and I'm still spending quite a bit of time to prepare it. So that's another thing I was doing. While doing all this, I kept publishing with my usual frequency on my Patreon page. The fact that so many of you bothered to send me a text to know if I was all right, but didn't bother to make a quick check on Patreon whether I was still posting something or not, makes me think that you're all not subscribed to my Patreon page because you don't know the existence of it, maybe. Should I mention it more? My Patreon page is the reason why I am able to make my YouTube videos by as little as one dollar per month or even more, it's up to you. My patrons can access to extra content plus all the benefits attached to that. If you're an affectionate subscriber and you believe in supporting independent creators, I see no reason why you wouldn't contribute on Patreon. What I get in exchange? I get an income, a very cheap one, <laughs> but I'm happy with that. In case you didn't notice, I've never, in almost four years of What A Shame Mary Jane, I've never taken a sponsorship or a brand deal on this channel. Why? Well, maybe nobody wants me. Maybe I never received an offer for collaboration. <laughs> I actually receive consistently a couple of collaboration offers by brands every single week, which makes it more than a hundred offers or requests per year. So no, that's not the reason. So why do I keep rejecting them? Maybe I'm against YouTubers making an income via sponsorships. No, I'm actually in principle not against it at all. On the contrary, I think it's a great collaboration. It's something where everybody gets something valuable in exchange. The real reason why I've never done a sponsorship on my channel is that I have yet to receive an offer by a brand that makes me think, wow, these guys really got it right. They are doing such an amazing job contributing to the evolution of humanity. They are enriching our society. I really want to contribute in the promotion of their service or their product. It's really gonna be worth it. 
it's as simple as that, honestly. I committed to live my life ethically. And so also the business that I do is ethically made. I don't consider an ethical business choice trying to persuade your audience to buy a product or a service just because someone paid you to do so. It's not only about an exchange of money, there is also something moral behind this exchange. And if you just ignore that part, the risk is to damage the people who trust you and who subscribe to your channel. In case you didn't know, by far the main source of income for the vast majority of YouTubers is brand deals. So by rejecting all these offers, I'm really cutting off most of my income. <laughs> and since the ads that you see on my videos don't even pay for my groceries, Patreon is my main source of income. Literally, my main source of income is the smallest to the biggest contribution that every single patron does on my Patreon page. Going back to the reason why you click this video, which is the title. Yes, I took time off of weekly vlogs to make a huge mega vlog, sort of, which you can now watch and it's one hour, 45 minutes long. So it's gonna keep you entertained for quite a long time. And I promise you're not gonna get bored. In the meantime, I kept posting my regular content on Patreon. And now if you discover something new and you change your idea about Patreon, well, you know where to subscribe. I put a link to my Patreon page underneath every single one of my videos on YouTube. So what to expect from What Is I Mary Jane now? Well, things are going to get going again on the YouTube channel, but I'm not gonna say anything more because if you want to know what's happening next, you can just subscribe to the newsletter. Navigate on the website, there are several subscription forms there. And I mean, it's a free thing that you can unsubscribe within literally two clicks in case you don't like it. That's all from today from the Julian Alps. Goodbye. I'll see you soon.